Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. So today I have the newest coach green with the toilet for men and I believe this was recently released in April actually. I got this from My Origins which is a website based in France for a relatively affordable price. I would say I got this for about 55 British pounds to maybe 60 pounds. I can't quite remember including shipping and it came within a week I would say. So the bottle looks like this, it has a very, as you can imagine, a very green kind of uh, hue to it and there's this tag on its neck, it says Coach New York. So looking at the note breakdown in front of you, the top notes are kiwi and bergamot, the middle notes are rosemary and geranium and the base notes is cedar and moss so it seems like this fragrance is a kind of a woody aromatic uh, fresh and spicy kind of a fragrance and as you can see the bottle i've not really used all of it and i did decant some out for my friends and family to let them try and kind of experience what's like to wear this and the first thing that i noticed uh, is that it's very similar to coach open rope I'll put up a picture so you have a good reference of what I mean. I've also done a review on that so you can take a look at that video if you want. And it also reminded me a little bit of Dior Sauvage Oude Toilette. Uh, I know it sounds crazy but the opening starts off with a very strong kiwi and bergamot as well as the kind of a rosemary and geranium combination. Uh, so in to summarize it, it's kind of like how Dior Sauvage would open up but rather than the pepper note, this Coach Green opens up with a kiwi note. So take out the pepper note and replace it with a kiwi and you get this fragrance essentially. That's what I think of this fragrance and the longevity and projection is I would say quite good given for how cheap and affordable this is so I get about maybe six to seven hours on my skin and 12 and hours and above on my clothes. So given that this is an eau de toilette, it's actually quite surprising how long this could last. And it projects okay, I would say it projects about an arm's length and then it just turns to the skin scent after, but the dry down can smell a little bit uh, synthetic to some people, well to me I think that it does smell like that because of the moss note and the cedar wood note so don't get alarmed by it and um, yeah the only other thing I would like to mention is that I'm not quite a fan of the atomizer spray for Coach, uh, especially this lineup. Uh, I think it's the same for Coach Platinum and Coach Blue as well from the previous years. I'm not really a fan of how this like turns and you know disables and enables it I think it's a bit redundant and it also leaks quite often from the nozzle so that's just one disadvantage of this kind of bottle design but other than that the scent wise it's great it's good if you've tried this please let me know what you think of this because I'm really curious what other people think whether I'm going crazy to think this smells quite similar to Dior Sauvage. That's pretty much all I need to mention, so I will catch you all in my next video.